Hello, my name is Caitlin with West Palm Dog, and today I'm here with Pippin, and we're going to be working on his down. Now, what we're going to be doing today is a lot of lowering four down, because we're working towards a verbal cue. Now, I'm sitting in a chair because that's the easiest way to start a down, but I'm going to go ahead, put him in a sit position, and at first, what I've been doing is taking the food and just making a straight line down. Yes! And the second he's down, I'm quickly treating multiple times to imply that stay. Okay, and I'm tapping on the head to release that behavior. So we're gonna go ahead and do that a couple more times just to warm up Pippin. Hey. Yes. And you see, these multiple treats are going to imply a stay, just like we would for sit, okay? And it'll prevent Pippin from just popping up and walking away. All right, one more time. Yes, good boy. And the second he's on his elbows, that's when I'm going to mark that behavior with a yes. Okay? Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to start pointing to the ground instead of completely luring by his nose. Like I said, we're working towards a verbal cue, and that means that we're slowly gra gravitating away from that lure. Pippin! See, he's in a sit. Yes! And the second he's on his elbows, I'm still marking that behavior the same. That's that magic moment. Okay? I'm going to toss some food, and we're going to do that again. Pippin! Yes! Good boy! Tap on the head. Okay. And that was a really nice drop from Pippin. I love how quickly he's dropping to the ground. The next step is to start adding that verbal cue, which as you can see will be a lot easier now that there's a lot less luring going on. But overall, very nice drop from Pippin.